Convicted murderer Jeffrey Willis will be present for victim impact statements when he is sentenced today for the 2013 murder of Jessica Haringa. Governor Rick Snyder passed the bill requiring criminals to remain in court during victim impact statements after Willis left the courtroom and blew a kiss towards the grieving family and friends of Rebecca Bletch. Oh, he three, four, kiss a jogger who he shot to death in 2013. Willis was also convicted in May for the kidnapping and murder of Jessica Haringa. One open murder, guilty of first degree murder. Guilty of first degree premeditated and first degree felony murder. Count two, kidnapping, guilty. Haringa was a 25-year-old mom who went missing from her job at an ExxonMobil gas station. Her body has never been found. Evidence collected from outside the gas station linked Jeffrey Willis to the crime. That that particular blood stain was collected by the police and later analyzed by the Michigan State Police Crime Lab, and it came back to Jessica Lynn Herring. Investigators also recovered this, moving it on to allow further examination and analysis under the new StarMix system. And more importantly, he talked about seeing male components to that profile. And we know from Ms. Schmidt's testimony that although it's a low number, it's not zero. The defendant is not excluded. Witnesses testified in the trial to seeing Willis's van at the Exxon Mobil that night. And where do you see the silver van? It's in the parking lot, traveling east toward the store. Okay, what's going on in your mind? Something wasn't right. Okay. The state relied heavily on evidence from the Rebecca Bletch case during the Haringa trial. Close by where Miss Bletch was killed and where her body lay in the roadway, he finds and discovers two more spent long rifle, 22 shell casings, CCI brand. And evidence recovered from Willis's home and his computer. Um, murder videos, kidnapping videos, abduction videos, sexual assault, rape videos. Uh, there was thousands and thousands and thousands of those type of videos on these external hard drives. A web page, a uh, complete web page that is saved uh, in that folder about Jessica Herringa. Some of the most critical testimony came from a teenage girl who claimed Willis tried to abduct her in 2016 while walking home from a party. Turning left is when he told me his phone was dead, and that's when I told him to stop the car and let okay. me out. And at any point in time, did the vehicle stop? No. I mean, even slow down to a point where you could safely get out? No. What happens next? Um, he's just staring at me, and I'm asking him to please stop, and he goes underneath his seat and pulls the gun out. Willis is currently serving a life sentence for the murder of Rebecca Bletch and awaiting trial for the alleged kidnapping of the teenager. For the murder and kidnapping of Jessica Haringa, he faces a mandatory life sentence. For Law and Crime, I'm Rachel Stockman.